The principle of thixotropy is generally applied in all of the following formulations except Option A, calamine lotion B, trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole suspension C, penicillin G-procaine depot injection D, lenoxin elixir Thixotropy is a characteristic of non-Newtonian substances which do not obey Newton's equation of flow. Let's understand the term first, thixis means stir or stress, and trophy means change. Thixotropy refers to the property of certain substances or materials to exhibit a time-dependent change in viscosity when subjected to stress or agitation. In simpler terms, thixotropic materials become less viscous, or thinner or more fluid, when they are stirred, shaken, or subjected to shear stress. And they return to their original, more viscous state when the stress is removed and they are left undisturbed. Thixotropy is a reversible process, meaning that the material can repeatedly transition between its more fluid and more viscous states, depending on the presence or absence of stress. The principle of thixotropy is applied in the preparation of various pharmaceutical products such as suspension, emulsion, lotions and parenteral depot preparation etc. It is not applied for preparation of elixir. Therefore, the answer is option D. If you find this video helpful, share it with others who may find it useful too. Subscribe Medbook for more Pebec questions. Thanks for watching.